put your hand, go walk. Your name go open doors. You self go be a boss. Amen. Amen. Everything you put your hand, go walk. Your name go open doors. You self go be a boss. Amen. Amen. Every hustler gets in pay. Where the hustle go, come the pay. Your own in no go take. Thank you. 
Sante sana kwa makaribisho na mapokeo ambayo mshatupatia na sasa tutakanyanga hii hinji kuanzia saa hii katika jina ya Yesu Kristo na umetangazia uwezo na uwepo wa Yesu Kristo katika boma hii Shia sante sana eh, na kwanza kabla tujaendelee tukipenda kuchukua nafasi hii pia kuwapa pole aliye uh, watokea kutaza baba yetu kwa hivyo Mungu awafariji mema na tuendelee na maisha hiyo tunajua kwa sababu ya Ukristo na uaminifu wetu kwa Yesu Kristo mshafarijiwa kwa hivyo tunarudisha asante sana na naomba tuendelee na mpangilio wa Mungu wetu kama vile Bangwa. Thank you very much. Amen. Everything you put your hand over, the name will open doors. You self go be a boss. Amen. Amen. Sister, where one man sits, until where they fight begin. One day you go on to his. Amen. Thank 
Wasema anaitwa Petunara Agwao. Yeye ni mama wetu hapa. Wana Yesu asifiwe. Amen. Kwa majina naitwa Mary Agongo. Huyo mzee ndio mke wangu. Naokoka napenda Yesu kama mkozi wa maisha yangu. Ninapokaa hapa hapa ni kwa Mungu wangu. Asanteni. Habari zenu? God is good all the time. Mimi ni Cyprus Atieno Olu. Mimi ni sister ya huyu mama mama hii mama sijana. Asante. Yosopaki, <laughs> Nasema kwa majina anaitwa Ionia Anyumba. Yeye ndio mama wetu mkubwa kwa hii boma. Ameshukuru Mungu sana kwa kuwafikisha hapa siku ya leo na ni <laughs> <laughs> Chunyo pa kuruwa tuko mchopo maru manya sayo hito umuti munu mabere ma uchopo mabere. Waduwa kwa hino kamano ni nyasai. Anigi nyinge gailungo ni yunia, oga, agengo. Aero luwa chiesu kaka jawari na mato di chunya. Apa kuruwa tu. Ma, enka yura. Eni muduwa, edalaka, ae jaoda. Amesema kwa majina anaitwa Yunia Ooga Ye ni shemeji ya mwenye iboma Hame wakaribisha sana na buwana sikiwe sana Habari sen Naitwa afli na nyumba Mama ya Chris. Christine. Ye ye ndi umama ke mstia. Ye ye ndi umifanya kutika pa leo. Mwana Yesu asifiwe. Asifiwe Yesu Christo. Ni mchana muema ni mwakoka Christo ni mwana. Mine ni mesimama hapa mbele yenu kwa majina na hitwa Rose Atieno Anyumba. Mimi ndiyo dada ya kikristi ni mkubo. Kuna wakaribisha sana, feel free, feel at home. Tumsifi Yesu Kristo, milele na milele. Kwa majina na hitwa Mary Atieno Anyumba. Mimi ndiyo dada ya kikristi ni mwapili, sijana wapili, nafata hui ndi mkubo wa laku mimi. Karibuni sana. Wana sifiwe. Sifiwe tete. Majina naitua Minset. Mimi ni sister ya Christi. Sijana ya tatu. Mimi ni sijana wa tatu. Nafota mimi. Nafota mimi. God is good. And all the time. God is good. Kwa majina na ito wakoleta anyumba, mimi ndiyo nafuata kristi. 
So kwa sababu last bona yuko leo mimi ndio last bona. <laughs> God is good and all the time. So now na kuka na watu na pata salamu zingine mbi. So so mimi yo kijana mwenye ni kwa vile kusai kijana mkubwa alienda kwa mambo mengine mahali atatujoin data and then mdogo pia amepata kitu atatujoin data nimewakaribisha sana feel at home feel free jadala peru kama thank you jadala asante ni sana uh, this makes much ni mzuri sana Omea sani ni wa nyono Kiswahili eh? Yeah. Gigi karone baendelea. Ni mondo ni kama moro. Angiski. Sawa. Ah, nishawaombea tiari. Ombe ni ruhusu niwaambie. Kuna ruksa ya kuchukua ingine. Hata ungefurahia hiyo. Wamesema kuna ruksa ya kuongeza kwa sababu mmoja huyu ambaye mnimchukua amefanya Kiswahili imefika kwa boma. Unajua sisi huku kwetu hata kama tuna maprofesa lakini Kiswahili si mdomo che. Watu wamefurahi, wamesema karibuni sana. So ninaenda kuachia nafasi na nyinyi pia tuwajue. Sisi kama watu wa nyumbani. Dongoko kwa pongege. Yeah. So I believe hakuna mtu ambaye ni bubu. Kwa hiyo kila mtu atataje jina lake. Sawa sawa. Where do I start? Madam, I start with you. Thank you. Thank you bwana MC. Eh uh, Tomsifi yes Kristo. Milele na milele. Thank you very much for your introduction. Tumefurahia sana kus kupata kuwajua na sisi tungependa sasa msikie majina yetu na vile MC amekuwa akisema ni kama tuko boma mbili kuna wale wanatoka huko Machakos na Christine na uh, umze hapa can you mention the name Felix my son wanaishi Mombasa wame na rafiki wengi na wamekuja na marafiki wengi kutoka Mombasa. Hivyo mnaona kutakuwa na haja kwa wale marafiki wa kutoka Mombasa wazijisemee majina yao. Thank you. Nitaanza na mimi kama mswahili naitwa Gerald Mutua. Wanzalu. Mimi ni yango ya Felix, ni yango ya Kristen na ni brother wa my brother here Daniel Kenyutu Zalu Zesi mama baba Wewe ndio baba ya Felix na Jacinda Mamona wewe Bas zinga la mtu karibu Wewe ndio kimoa chote Maana ende nyawana eh Maana nyawana Thank you thank you Thank you for making it easy for me. Basi wacha ni wa introduce kwa vijana wa boma hiyo ambayo ni my brothers na cousins wa Felix na Jacinda. Eh mmoja ni yule anaitwa Finston Ikusia Kimetu ni kijana ya our eldest brother. Kimetu Vincent kijana wa our eldest brother ambaye anaishi huko Machakos Yata. Sawa, tumepaka hiyo. Kwezi nisha kumalizia. Aya, huyo ni ndio Felix. Huyo <laughs> ndio Felix. Eh, Mbale wa Kinyutu. This is the Kinyutu mwenyewe. Bas. 
Heo ndio mwenye hii sherehe yote. Tutapitia pale Masila, Mr. Masila. Huyu ni mtoto ya my sister. Our last should I say last born sister in that family. Ni Chalo. Chalo. Forgive me for not remembering the name. Hawa vijana walikuwa hivi juzi juzi majina na inaleta tanisha saingine. <laughs> Thank you Chalo. Eh Naona hii jamba hii. Look at him and look at Felix. Sini kitorobu moja, sini sanuku moja ilijenga hiyo mawe, hiyo mawe. Good, sir. Basi, anaitua Kiyoko. Leo badi zoe doa. Stani li Kiyoko wa Kinyutu. Kuna mawe moja zoezi koza kuhitu. a great friend of our mother hao vijana ambaye alisema hata kama kisumo ni mbali lazima afike huku akuje kuona kwa nyakisumo we call i call personal i call that girl christian nyakisumo sorry hii ba nimewanyang'anya msichana wenu mtanisamee sawa good anaitwa joina modi ni neighbor yetu pale wa munyu is a great friend of the family na ni mkristo ameokoka Yesu ni mwokozi wake eh at yan gao there at the corner anaitwa Janet amule ya mutunga do i say that is a wife of my greatest friend of my youth of my toddler life big network of friends that's why kuna watu wa Mombasa, kuna watu wa Machakos, na pia kuna watu wa Nairobi. Na mimi pia nitawaambia natoka wapi. Mardan Feva Feva. Mombasa. Bali zeno. Bwana sifiwe. Amen. Naitwa Mwema Madui. Bali. Na kazi pamoja. Asanteni sana watu wa Kisumu. Thank you. na mimi nachukua kusahihi nikusalimie nyote katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Amjamboni. It is my first time mara yangu ya kwanza kushiriki kwa kongamano ya my friends the liberal people na na sisi watu wa Eastern na nimependezwa. In fact kwa gari nilikuwa na mmoja wenu nikaona muuliza mashati mtu akinaingia juu wa shati ameweka ndani ama ametoa tuzije tukozeshe rafiki yetu mke wake lakini akaniambia mambo si mabaya sipokuwa tu ngombe mpaka mwingine nazo kwa kiki ndio maana zimetangulia na nikaona labda huo ndio mwiko na miiko yenu na yetu inaingiliana the tradition is just the same na ito Charles Muli au mwingine ya mwisho tumeambiwa tusitaki kwa sababu mtu ya juu you can't pronounce them i'm charles mimi ni mtoto wa kwa kina felix nimeoa niko na mke na watoto wawili na mtoto mmoja anasoma oma bay sitaki kupoint kwa sababu naweza point huko kama sio oma bay anasoma oma bay lakini nikiwa hapa i don't know the direction of oma bay akale kingine niko na hapo nyumbani na tunashukuru mungu tunampenda mungu na ndio maana tumekuja huko kwa upendo. Safari kama hii inangalia upendo tu. Otherwise you could have been taxi. Kwa hivyo asandeni na ningependa direction mmoja aje achukuliwe lakini naona ni kama wote wameenda. Isipokuwa hiyo last bond yako ongelele wa sana. Lakini thank you very much. Zenu. Kwa majina na ipo Chris Kelele. Mimi ni rafiki yake Felix. Nasikika. Mm. Kwa majina ni Fred Musui. Mimi ni rafiki wa karibu wa Felix na zaidi ya kuwa rafiki tulisoma naye kidato kimoja high school na sea boys. Na licha hiyo ya family friends eh, uh
Madam Christine ametupikia ile kiveri ya njugu kwa muda ikiwa Mombasa so we have been friends na ni jirani pia kule ukangani nashukuru Habari zenu kwa vizuri kwa majina naitwa Boniface Mwanza nimeokoka Yesu ni bwana uh, mimi ni rafiki wa Felix kutoka kio wa kijana mdogo uh, tukiwa tunaenda camp youth camp akiwa tuja kusoma na Mosui so mimi nikajua Mosui kupitia kwa Felix naye Felix kutoka kuja Mombasa nikampata alifika Mombasa na kaanza biashara ingine ilikuwa ya kubeba basi na na pikipiki then akanitudusi kwa hiyo biashara tukakaa akaoa mbele yangu na mimi nikakuweka nikaoa na tunakaa karibu kwa hivyo nikumaanisha bibi yangu akileta kichwa ngumu naongea na Felix tunapeleka hao watu out wanaenda <laughs> wana relax wanakuja vizuri na tunakaa tena vizuri kwa hivyo ni jirani na tunaendelea vizuri kwa hivyo function tulikuwa tunakuja huku kwa sababu ya ujirani mzuri na kukaa pamoja na Felix ipendi kuitwa na mtu na sijui maisha yake yamekaa hadi na vile ni kwa nimekiwa Felix anakaa vizuri kutoka akiwa kijana mpaka mahali tumefikia nikakubali kuwa chairman kwa kumwapelaise watu tukuje huku na si mmetuona sasa tunangojia mimi nikaambia Felix kuji sana kwa sababu naenda kukula breakfast ya njugu na chai na kideri ya njugu kwa hivyo uh, najua tumeko mahali pa sawa si Mungu atubariki tunapokuwa hapa na kukua na nyuso za tabasamu ndio hata Felix asikie mzuri. Si ni wewe mzuri? Ahari kama. Habari yenu nyote. Kwa majina ni Whitney Akeo ama Whitney Borege, mimi ni Swake. Felix, 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 Felix,
Felix anasema atachagua tu. Bado wanaangalia. Sasa Felix umeniambia unajua, nikikwambia wewe ndio unionyeshe ni upi. Lakini sababu ya ujui na bado nataka kuangalia, tutatumia kitu inaitwa elimination process. Yule ambaye sie kumweke hapa kando. Hapa kando hapo. Kuna mtu tumekuja nae kutoka Mombasa ambaye ajao hapa. Kuna mtu ambaye tumekuta nae Mombasa ajao. Apewe ruhusa. Apewe ruhusa. Apewe. Tumekuwa huku watu ni wengi. Na tumekuja wengi pamoja wao njoo njoo nione kando. Nataka kupatia yuko wapi? Kioko Kioko. Kioko. Kioko mbona ano? Oh, kioko mbona? Leo ndugu yake analajua. Sasa mwingine maneno. Haya, DJ Kuleta ngoma ya kikamba ni wewe nasema hii ni yangu na hii ni yako. Sasa tunataka kujua yake ni gani. Nipe hiyo kitu DJ. Hey. Hey, 
Ninakwatie ngai wa kwa ninakwatie tatae 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 Yeye ninakwatie ngai wa kwa ninakwatie tatae Ninakwatie ngai wa kwa ninakwatie tatae Ta 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 yangwa Ta 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 yangwa Ta 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 ta
Haleluya. Kama hauna furaha jiulize umembeba nani? Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Biblia inasema ya kwamba tusherekee na wale wanaosherekea. Na tuomboleze na wale ambao wanaomboleza. Leo ndugu na dada familia mpya imetengenezwa hapa duniani na mpaka mbinguni ikiwa huwezi kufurahia umembeba nani. Haleluya. No katika sherehe kama hii inatakikana meno yako yawe nje. Siku ya leo ni ya kusherekea. Lakini ni lazima tujikumbushe kile ambacho tunafanya inaambatana na neno la Mungu ama aliambatana na ni nini kinamfurahisha Mungu ambayo tukitenda mbingu zinafurahikia. Haleluya. Siku ya leo kwa kijaluo tunaita nyombo. Na kamba tunaita eh zau ngasia. So tumekuwa na nyombo na ngasia na nyombo na ngasia inaleta kitu kimoja inachoitwa familia ama marriage. Kweli? Na hakuna institution ambayo shetani anapigana nacho kama ndoa. There is no institution under the sun that the devil is fighting as much as he's fighting marriage. Maybe aje kufikia lakini kama unaona haije kufikia labda auje kuwa makini sana. Ni wangapi wameoa na nyumba zao zimefanywa arena ya boxing? Ni watu wangapi wameoa na watoto wao hawahesabiki kama watoto? Ni wangapi wameoa lakini katika nyumba zao hawana uzao wa tumbo? Ni watu wangapi wameoa na kila akizaa mtoto anakufa waluo wanaita ya kisoni kwa hivyo kuoa tu sio kuleta na kuleta na kuunganisha ukishafanya vile ujiandae kuna vita na ile vita anayeweza kutushindia ni Jehova Mungu peke yake haleluya so ningependa tufahamu ya kwamba marriage was ordained and initiated by God himself at the garden of Eden there was no committee arusi ya Mungu haikuhitaji committee ya Felix na Mrs Felix tumekuwa wana committee but we are just carrying on on a foundation that was laid by God himself and he did not have any committee except God the Father God the Son God the Holy Spirit when Felix was alone ameambiwa go and dominate and fill the earth that is the word that God said but Felix when Felix was alone 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 Felix kana nikende tokonyal timo manenya sayo acho ni mondo team go and multiply Felix plus Felix can they multiply Felix multiplied by Felix can they become two so God said hence God himself said it is not good for man to be alone so Mungu ndiye alisema Felix si vizuri akika peke yake hata kama anafanana na Mungu hata kama yeye ni mzuri namna gani lakini sio vizuri kwa Felix kuwa peke yake so it is not good for me and you if you are a man like me it is not good for you to be alone i have not said it is god who has said it men in the house men in the house do you still love me men in the house do you still love me You see the more we go before our God the faster the agenda item number seven will come faster How can you be God's only one way No two ways about it 
Inyalo mana bedo mar nyasaye kiluwo yo achiel kende. Onge yo achiel gi nus, onge yo ariyo. Ni yo achiel. Only one. Only one. And that one costed God himself. There is only one way to him so that you belong to him. And the Bible says in Jeremiah 10 and verse 23. O oh Lord, I know that the way of man is not in himself. Jia ya mwanadamu haimo kwake mwenyewe. Yorda ano okni kuome uwon. So, kiki uwon dani ngeyo. <laughs> muma ya mawacha. Baba, donge simbino niki muma? Okay, ba. Ha, gomponi ngatu go som. Kika be na wacho kikumakia. Maane mange kumagoni. Nijo tuneza toa Biblia ya Mombasa tukaleta hapa. Na ni vizuri hawa watu hapa pia wakikisha kama ni kweli. What our Bible in Mombasa is saying is what their Bible is saying. The Bible says, I know that the way of man is not in himself. It is not in man that walketh in direct, to direct his steps. Wewe uwezi ukajiongoza. It is either God leading you or the devil leading you. So that is why I say, to whom do you belong? When you belong to the devil, the devil will lead you. You belong to God, God will lead you. And you want to board a vehicle, rowa mungu anatumu anakuambia, don't go. You insist on going, iwoke dalani, you are on a boda boda, that boda boda, pangala, umeanguka, lakini usinge kwa ile gari. After a few moments, unasikia, imeusika kwa jali, watu saba wameenda, lakini wewe ulivunjika mugu. Ni kwa sababu you are not listening to the leading of God. Unataka kwenda Nairobi, unataka kwenda Nairobi, unasikia, I must go by air. Kitu tu inakuchelewesha, chelewesha, 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 flight imeenda. Ukifika pale, after 40 minutes, unasikia, imeanguka, hakuna mtu ndani. It was God who was leading you. That is the benefit of godly leading. Wana yesu wa sifiwe sana. So as I finish, in John 1, verses 12, John 1 and verses 12 of the Bible says, But as many as received him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God. Receiving who? Jesus Christ. And you see, it was a price. To give out your only begotten son for one mankind in the name of Nelson to be reconciled to God. It costed God. John 3 and verse 16. It costed God. And he did die for me only. He died for all of us. Therefore, if you have not accepted him, niwewe mwenye, but he is ready. Arms open. Come, my son. Come, my daughter. I'm waiting for you to return you back to where you belong. Hallelujah. Amen. So, even to them that believe on his name. So, it is not fashion, but this is the instruction from the Bible. You will be born, you will live. One day, we will all die. I feel sorry that when I entered here, I saw where my, our daddy was laid. All of us are going there. It may be today, it may be tomorrow, it may be next year. Nobody knows the time. Only God knows the time. When Parapanda Italia, will you come smiling? You can only smile when you know that God has been leading you and his way is the right way. And his way is taking you to eternal life. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. May somebody among us here make this occasion to be memorable in their life. Chie moro paru. Arus marinya rungane. Nome ya dogo ili Yesu Christo. Nome ya dogo ili nyasai. The wedding of so and so made me come back to God. If I would have such a person, heavens will be very happy. The Bible says, when one man, when one man, one man, one soul, one soul, 
returned to God, heavens are happy. Heavens are happy. Whether you buy manyumba, you buy ma, ma, magari, you buy get, build magorofa, everybody is happy, but heaven is not happy. Hallelujah. It is not bad to buy. It is very good. Because even in the Bible, men were using chariots. Eh? Chariots. And as born again, we are the ones who are supposed to enjoy these things. But ki donjo e polo polo duto Let us be on our feet. Somebody appreciate God for the word. Just lift up your voice, lift up your hands. Father, we thank you. We appreciate you. You have spoken to us, Lord. We give you the honor. This night, Lord, we don't take it for granted. We appreciate you. We glorify you. Now, if you know that God has spoken to you and you are having a conviction that your ways are not right with God, Maybe you are born again. Uliokoka kitambo. I had it yesterday. Is not having it today. I made it yesterday. Is not a testimony today. Nilikuwa na lori kumi. Hauna lori leo. Hiyo ni historia. Unajua hauja okoka. Unajua njia zako si sawa mbele za mwenyezi mungu. Weka mkono wako wakulia. Kifuwa ni mwako. Kingeyo lipo kowari. Tiko mbomo na nyasayo wari. Kaulueti makot kachichi, kete duchunyi makot kachamu, kama chunyi nitiere. Wajikoda, wana yesu, naja kwako, natambuwa mimi ni mwenye dami. Sister hili mbele zako, nimetenda dambi, mengine kwa kujua, na mengine kwa kutujua. Nina kuomba jioni ya leo. Unitakase na damu ya mwanao Yesu Kristo na unisamee makosa yangu yote andika jina langu katika kitabu cha uzima na wakati utakaporudi kuchukua ulimwengu niwe katika msafara wako leo ninakiri kwa kinywa changu kwamba ye wewe ni bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yangu nimeokoka na kuamini na sote tuseme amen, amen. tupigie bwana yesu mkono sio mimi nimeshinda ni yesu ameshinda tunaweza kuketi we uko na baba mbili kaka Now, ukimeka tuwa moja, hebu meka tuwa moja, uh -huh. na we meka moja, thank you, meka another one, meka another one, hiyo natosha kwa. Uje pewa kwa, so tatara juju pewa, so ungea karibu na mtoto wako, na we so ungea karibu na mtoto wako. Now, give them your hand, uh, right hand. Uh -huh. uh, very good. Now, we pia utafanya hivo hivo. Jadung maklu wete makwacha cha. Dung kwacha cha mudu wa mie godo. Dung kudu wa mie. Uh -huh. Na we pia shika mkono yako na muna hiyo. Shike li yeye wawili. <coughs> hey, kama ano. Uh -huh. Aya, we nyosha tu, wa shike kwanza. Eh, hey, we, usishike kwanza. <laughs> Kaya na mkono, shika mkono. Unaona pila wame shika hile, na nyi pia shika hivo. Now, si tunashuhudia. Uh -huh. Let's believe God and pray. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, this I is your daughter and this is your son. You created them out of each other. And Father, you destined them to be together. Today, their parents, their, their earthly parents, 
are giving them out to each other. Lord, we ask you to send your angels to do the union in the mighty name of Jesus. Now give it. Give them now. Give them now. Higher. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, from heaven, we are witnesses that today, date 21st of this month, your daughter and your son has been given officially in the mighty name of Jesus. And whatever you have put together, let no man put to asunder in the mighty name of Jesus. No pressure of life will put them asunder. No pressure from friends. No pressure from the children. No culture will bring them apart in the mighty name of Jesus. Can we celebrate our good God for bringing them together, together, together in the mighty name of Jesus? Congratulations are in order. Now, I want you two to nail down the lady and the son. And then... I think you should look the other side. Eh? Wale ndio mashahidi. Now, wekelea mkono yako kwa kichwa chake, anza kumwombea na ile lugha unayopenda. Na wewe ambaye umebaki kule na mimi, ninuka kwa miguu yako, nyosha mikono yako hapa, pata kunena one word. Sema neno la baraka kuhusu hii familia ambayo inaanzishwa leo baba katika jina la Yesu tunawaleta mbele zako tunawakabidhi katika mkono wako tunakuomba bwana achilia roho yako ipate kuongoza ipate kuongoza bwana jioni ya leo tunakuomba wacha moto wako upate kuazingira adui yeyote asipate kupenya katika hii familia baba tunakuwa shahidi kwa bomba weka pamoja tunakuomba Bingu yote ipate kuishi nao Bingu yote ipate kukaa nao wacha waone matunda usao kila upande ya tumbo ya biashara ya kikazi wacha baraka sije unasema bwana yule amepata mke amepata kitu chema na anapata kibali wacha kibali iwe katika maisha mwanao Felix Jonia leo baba tunasema ni asante maana umepokea maombi yetu na ume jibu tayari katika jina la Yesu Kristo tumeomba na kuamini na sote tuseme mena piga makopo anapoinuka you can now hug your beautiful husband and handsome wife you can kiss your husband your 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 your, 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 your handsome wife and you can also Hallelujah. <laughs> 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 jina la bwana litukuzwe amen tunaweza rudi kwa viti vyetu asante sana kwa wakati wewe
Teddy Samora Oh, my God. 
Watoto wakuja tu dance. Kuja ni. Kuja kuja kuja. 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 Kuja ni. Kuja